The Texas Stars hockey team is in the process of trying to find the next star goalie. It's arguably the most important position on the ice. Simply put, if the opponent doesn't score, you can't lose. I want to introduce you to Texas Stars rookie goalie, Philippe Derosier. That's right, 20-year-old Philippe Derosier has allowed a team low 2.51 goals against average and has a .91 save percentage, which is also tops amongst four Texas Stars goalies. I think I've been playing pretty well and we also have a good team, so that's helped for our goalies, so that's great. There's always room for improvement, especially when you are inexperienced like DeRossier. Texas Stars head coach Derek Laxdahl knows playing goalie at the professional level is a learning experience day in and day out. Well, he's a young goaltender right now. We're kind of running with the young kids, and you know, one of the things he's working at his game is not playing so deep, and that's just going to be an area development. So he's going to find out where, when he can push, when he can step out, and uh, he's been pretty solid for us over the last couple weeks, and he's given us a chance to win some games. So. For us, it's, it's, it's part of development. We're in the winning business, we're in the development business, and that's just part and parcel with a goaltender or a forward or a defenseman. It feels great, you know, uh, all my career, my dream was to like play in the NHL, and now I'm one step closer to the NHL, so that's good, and as a goalie, it's, it's a long process, you know. I'm not going to be in the NHL next year, so uh, I gotta take, take time and work with the goalie coach here and learn how to play the good game, and I think it's, it's gonna be good for me. His growth, uh, you know, in the first couple of games has been good. Made some big saves. Made a big one on Rowdy there late in the third period when he got hit. Texas Stars goalie Philippe DeRossier remembers his first victory in a Texas Stars uniform. It happened on January 8th here at the Cedar Park Center against the Chicago Wolves. The Stars won that night 3-1. to one. My goal is, is to do a shutout every night, but it, it's not going to happen. But uh, overall, I think it's... It's just bad luck. Bad luck or not, the Texas Stars scored a game-tying goal Friday night against San Diego with 3.15 remaining in regulation, only to have the goals, a team the Stars had beaten in all three previous meetings this year, score less than a minute later off the Rossier, which was a bitter pill to swallow. But one more learning experience. <laughs> I've been lucky this year to play against good goalies, against NHL goalies, so it's, it's good. I, I have to learn from them and, and now and show that I'm good too. So, you know, uh, I want to be an NHL goalie one day and I got to work for it. I think it's just work hard and, and play hockey. Philippe de Rossier was a born winner though. Growing up near Montreal, he won a gold medal with Team Canada in the 2013 Under 18 World Junior Hockey Championships going 5-0 with a 0.80 goals against average and a .970 save percentage in the tournament. That was uh, three years ago and it was a lot of good good memories for that and obviously win it's, it's always good so uh, I'm looking forward to, to win here in Texas. Philippe stopped 33 shots in the gold medal game against Team USA. If that didn't catch the attention of the Dallas Stars, being named the CHL's 2014 Goaltender of the Year certainly did. Philippe posted a 29-3 record and a 2.5 goals against average with a .901 save percentage. DeRossier signed a three-year entry-level contract with Dallas on April 19th of 2014. I grew up watching the Montreal Canadiens and my, my dream was to maybe play in the NHL against them or with him. So. I think it's it's the goal behind all this, and I'm, I keep working for it. So remember the name, Philippe de Rossier. He might just be wearing a Dallas Stars uniform sooner than expected. Down on the farm at the Cedar Park Center, Jeff Power, Stars Insider.